guys, today I'm going to be unboxing some things I got on Amazon for the pets and then I'm going to be making like some sort of vlog afterwards of me just doing stuff in my room and maybe using some of this stuff I got. So let's get into the unboxing. So first we have this one and I already know um, all the things that are in here so it's not going to be like any surprise or anything. So we're going to open this one first. It says, do not crush. It's fragile. So I got some Indian almond leaves. I think there's 15 in here. They're a lot smaller than I thought they would be, but that's totally okay, especially with the amount there is. Okay, this is as far as I'll go into unboxing this. So here they are. Now we'll move on to the Z box. <laughs> So I ordered some things for my hamster and my fish, mostly my fish though. So first thing we have for the fish is this check valve. And the reason I need a check valve is because I got this air pump. And then we have the tubing for it. The one thing that didn't come in the mail yet is the air stone. So I'll show you a picture on the screen of what the air stone I ordered looks like. So we'll move on to this one. So much bubble wrap. So I got this thermometer for the community fish tank. Then for my hamster gizmo, I got some bath powder for him to roll around in. I'm sure he'll love that. And then I also got this Velcro for his water bottle to stick to the side of the aquarium. And then lastly for the for my beta fish I think actually is this heater. It's for up to two to ten gallons. I already have a heater but I need another one. So that's it for the haul. Now to set some things up. Let's give Gizmo a bath. Okay. Whoa, he's going away. That's a lot. Alright, let's see how he likes it. Oh, he likes it! Yay!
Do you like it, Gizmo? That would be a yes. <laughs> Alright, that time is, success, is a success. Now for a V Velcro. Okay, yeah, that's way too low. Okay, there we go. That's a success too. Yay! Sadly, I can't set up the uh, air pump because I don't have the air stone yet, so that's a bummer. But today I think I'm going to put the Dalmatian Molly, who is in quarantine right now, back into the community fish tank so that I can move my bed of fish comet back into the two gallon or three gallon whatever it is and then put the new heater in the two gallon and put the original heater back into the community tank because I'm pretty sure the fish in the community tank are tired of cold water so luckily they've survived through for a few days without a heater but today, hopefully, they get one back. So I'm going to go do that. It's going to be a lot of tank cleaning and stuff. But after that, I'm going to take Cody on a walk and maybe bring you guys with. I don't know. I might get some, like, outside clips. But, yeah. So I better get started. So, so far I put the molly back into the community fish tank and I put the guppies in a net for now so that the Dalmatian molly can get used to the tank without the guppies bothering him. So I think now it's getting late so I'm going to go ahead and take Cody on a walk and probably end the vlog there. So here's what it looks like right now. There's the molly. And there's the guppies. Guys, so I'm on a walk with Cody right now and figured I'd just end the vlog here. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, I guess. If you like these kind of videos, I just comment down below and I might try to make more vlogs. I don't know. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.